Hello, my name is Larry Flash Jenkins. You probably know me from TV and film. I starred as Wardell Stone on The White Shadow. Um, I played Gummy and Fletch. You probably know that I'm the first actor to star in three straight series on NBC, ABC, and CBS. It's White Shadow on CBS, Space City Blues on NBC, Find Your Lost Love on ABC. But what you don't know is that I'm the best blackjack player in the world. Um, if they had poker, had us on TV the way they do poker players and stuff where well, you would know it. But what I want to do is just give you a quick demonstration on how to beat Vegas. A lot of people they have this misconception of you know how to beat Vegas and, and when to get a hit and when not to get a hit. There are certain things you have to know about playing blackjack, how to win besides just counting cards. You know, the people who count cards like me and other experts and stuff, we understand where you count the two, three, four, and five, and six as minus one. The seven, eight, nine is zero, and the 10, jack, queen, king, ace as plus one. A lot of people already know that because they got videos all over YouTube about that. Typically what I do is that I deal, I play against the dealer because I know I can beat the dealer because I can count the cards, okay? So we're gonna we're gonna do the deal right here. Let's say you're dealing, uh, you're playing with some people. Let's say it's three people. Okay, here, here, here. Count the cards. Okay. Now, now you see what's there. You see what's here. So let's turn it over so the audience can see it. Okay. So this person's gonna have to get a hit. Notice two threes are already gone. A single deck. Okay. A ten's going right there. All right, so what's going to happen, because this is showing and stuff, 9 out of 10, this is 10 up under here. You want to get a hit right here. So 7, 10. So now you should know that a facial card is coming. A facial card is going to come. So there it is. It's close, close enough. That's 10. That's 18 right there. All right, here, you got 19. So you got a hit. So everybody stayed. Let's see what they got. Like I said, they probably was going to have, have the 10. So they push, they lose, and they lose. But you took a good chance of getting it. Notice no facial cards came up. So if you count your cards right now, two queens are gone. A jack and a king is still out there. Three tens are still out there. You got three sevens. You got three twos. You got three eights. Three fours. And two threes are still out there. Keep that in mind if you want to count the cards. Okay? And you can do it the minus one the way the, the, the way the experts do it. Or just count them that way. Okay? So let's do that. That that and that. Okay? So now we're going to turn over here. That's 17. That's 19. Okay, that, that's 11. That's a dream hand. I love doing this hand like that. Alright, so 17 you just do like that. You stay. 19 you stay. Here you double down. There you go right there. I would have doubled down. If I'm betting 1,500, 2,000 hand, I would have doubled it down. I would have won 4 grand because I guarantee you the dealer ain't got that. 16 they got to get a hit. They bust it. So that's how you win that. Notice the eights up there now. That's two eights and stuff. We already counted the other eights and stuff. And there's a nine. There's a second ten. There's only one queen left. Keep that in mind. Two jacks left. Notice no aces has come up yet. So expect a lot of nice runs with aces. So right now, you up your bet. You like double, triple your bet. Because here comes the aces. Keep that in mind. They're going to be coming. There goes one of them. The aces are going to be coming fast and furious now so keep that in mind there's the first ace there's a 19 there's a blackjack okay so right here you get a hit 17 you stay because the six is showing now you're hoping that a facial card is up under there nine out of ten it's a facial if it's not let's see what happens okay it's a ten so now what you want is a small card you just praying and hoping it's a small card and you got it that's 12 now what you want is the facial Okay, so you got 10, 12, you got 17, everybody wins, they push. They win, they win, because this is 17 right here. Okay, notice that all the little cards are almost gone now. See the six, five, two, fours, and everything? One ace. And look at this deck that's left. That means three aces are still out there. No more queens now. Two kings are gone, so a lot of facial cards are gone now. So keep in mind, it's going to be another blackjack coming up. Okay, so let's see with this one. There's two. So they end with that. There go the blackjack I was talking about. Alright, so here we go with that. 789. A facial card has to be coming up right now for this. There it is. There's a 10. So they good. They got 19 right here. There go the, there go the third ace. Okay, 
So now you have to realize that you need a seven. I've not seen a seven come up yet. No sevens. So you take a chance and get a hit saying a seven got to be coming up, but you get a four. A four still was out there too as well as a seven, so that's 18. Let's see what this deal got. They got 18, so you push. You win, and you got blackjack. That's the second time this player got back-to-back -back blackjacks. Okay, so now it's one ace left with this here, one king left, and some jacks. Okay, so watch this, 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 this. We might not have enough cards, but you get the general idea. They'll go to that lone jack that was left. Okay, here, that's a 7, that's a 14, that's a 14, that's a 6, and they go to lone ace right there. That, that's the fourth ace, and they got 18 right there. So obviously, you, you know, that this way you'd get a hit. So I'm going to shuffle, and, it, and you got to get a hit anyway, even though I showed that ace. We're going to shuffle, and then let's see right here. There you go right there, 14, that's 20, right? 14 right there and stuff, you're busted. And here, you, uh, you're you going to want to stay even though I saw that card already. But this card here was going to win anyway because of the little card and stuff was going to pop up in the deck. So the best way to play blackjack, as I said, is to think and let the dealer bust out. You don't want to bust out. You want that dealer to bust out and count your cards and go get them.